Hello, my name is Jens and I've been given this opportunity to give you a brief overview of our most popular dental care unit, the Planmeca Compact i5. You might know the Compact line from before. There's over 50,000 of them in use globally. This is the fifth generation of the product line and with this generation we are pushing the usability and the hygiene concepts further than ever before. While building on the tradition and the experience we have from the previous product lines, like the side lifting chair, the small footprint, and the IT integration that future proves your investment. The side lifting frees up floor space under the chair. The chair itself can lift 185 kilos and hold a static load of over 1000 kilos. The side lifting means there will always be space for the legs, even when working forehanded, and for positioning the foot control ergonomically. The dentist can get really close to the patient and deliver the treatment without ergonomic compromises. We have many delivery arm options available, over the patient and side delivery, balanced arms and hanging hose, and cart. Today, we're going to focus on our most popular model, the over the patient balanced arm option. This dental care unit also has an integrated monitor. The monitor, much like an integrated intraoral x-ray, for example, is an option. You can have the dental unit without it or even without the light altogether. In this particular model, we have a left-right suction arm, chair-mounted, installed. This arm is one of the options. We have many others. This one works well for four-handed work and two-handed work, whereas some other options work better, for example, with four-handed work without interlocking legs. The over the patient balanced arm version is popular because it, it adapts well to most treatment positions. It also minimizes the need for class four and class five movements when you reach for the instrument. You can even bring the instruments in to your peripheral vision so that you can activate an instrument without shifting focus from the illuminated area in the mouth, meaning you create less eye strain from constantly looking into changing light conditions. The instrument delivery is easy to move. The arm joint by the light post rotates 360 degrees, meaning it's easy to find a working position for the instrument delivery that is suitable for working from seven o'clock to three o'clock. The tray table attaches to the instrument delivery. It's easy to move and to adapt, and there is a strong magnetic hold holding the tray in place. If you so desire, you can also easily remove the tray altogether. One option how to position the delivery arm of the i5 is like this. This particular arm is 520 millimeters long, but we do have a shorter 340 millimeter option available as well, which particularly well works in this kind of a setup. Naturally, we are now making it a challenge if you want to use the bowl. However, use of the spittoon is discouraged in a lot of countries, and we do get lots of orders for the i5 completely without a bowl. The benefit in a setup like this is before the patient enters, we can actually bring the instruments out of line of sight to create a more comfortable atmosphere. We have a very clean entry and exit for the chair. And after the care has been delivered, we can again take the instruments away, and in a four-handed setup, the assistant can start preparing the instrument delivery for the next patient, while the dentist sees this patient out of the chair and brings the next one in. 
Let's next focus a little bit more on our instrument delivery and take a look at the balanced arms that we have here. The I-5 balanced arms carry the weight of the instrument very well. There is no feeling of pullback. The instrument activation track is very short thanks to the mid-flexing of the arm. The arms are also sideways flexible, giving a very wide reach for every instrument. All instruments are quick, connected and movable. If you want to reposition a scaler or move a camera between rooms, it's possible and easy to do so. The exception is the syringe. The user interface and the syringe are positioned so that the assistant can reach them and the syringe is really there for the assistant mostly to use. Many times when the dentist reaches for the syringe it is to gain visibility with air. In the Compact i5 we can do the same thing when we have an instrument in hand. With an instrument in hand, by pressing down on the foot control, you get continuous chip blow that achieves the same thing. You can drive instruments and the chair from the foot control. You can also drive the chair from the touch panel graphical user interface and from the assistant element. From the foot control, you can additionally control other functions, such as OP light on and off, instrument spray on and off, and so forth. For those functions, we have two additional programmable buttons on the foot control. However, when it comes to instrument settings, those are controlled from the user interface. The panel adapts to different situations in the clinical workflow, when I activate one instrument, the settings for that instrument will be displayed. We have a wide range of instruments available for the i5. We have two three-way syringes and a six-way syringe. We have turbines, scalers from three manufacturers, a few micromotors to choose from, including surgical motors, endomotors and apex locators. We also have an intraoral camera and a curing light. Two non-rotational instruments can also be on the assistant side, where we can even integrate the Emerald S intraoral scanner as an instrument. The foot control is heavy to stay nicely in place during treatment. You can program it to work as a gas pedal, or with the sideways movement. You can have it wired or wireless. When not in use, there is a hook to hang it from. Let's take the patient away. Now we can have a better look at the chair itself. The backrest of the chair is very wide by the seat and narrows down a lot towards the headrest. The narrow bit is there for the dentist to get very close to the oral cavity of the patient. The wide part is there for the comfort of the patient. We do have optional armrests available. You can rotate them, you can remove them, and they can be a great benefit for the elderly patients to get in and out of the chair. However, many of our users feel that this part gives the patient sufficient support. With the width of the backrest and with the lack of armrests, most patients will be relaxing their elbows on the backrest and crossing their hands across the chest, which is a very comforting position that relaxes most of the muscles of the upper body. There is an option of an automatic leg rest. With this, you get a knee brake chair 
with leg rest and back rest movements synchronized. Patient entry with knee break is much easier. In consultations, this is also much more comfortable for the patient. With this setup, you can also achieve a perfectly horizontal chair position. You can lock the leg rest in two fixed positions. And if something adverse happens during the treatment, you can even reach a Trendelenburg position by first driving down until the backrest stops and then driving further to the Trendelenburg position. For the headrest, we have two different options available, motorized and manual. The motorized is great. You can pre-program the positions synchronized with the backrest positions. However, most of our customers still go for the manual one that we have here. It's double articulated, both joints activated by the same button. The height adjustment is done by a simple pull and push against the friction brake. It can also be completely removed. This might be useful for treating very young patients. For the young patients, we additionally have booster cushions available. If the headrest is removed and then turned, you can achieve a different position with the headrest. This position can be very beneficial, for example, for patients with a very slumped neck. With the chair, you also need to consider the highest and lowest achievable chair positions. This is part of dynamic ergonomics. You should have the option to stand up and work for a while, avoiding static postures. For this, you need a good height of the highest chair position. On the other end of the spectrum, you want to achieve as low a lowest chair position as possible. Some patients struggle with being tilted back. For a dentist to be seated with a patient semi-seated, you need as deep a lowest position as possible. We have two different upholsteries available, the comfy upholstery and the ultra-relaxed upholstery like we have here. The comfy upholstery is comfortable, soft, without any visible seams. The ultra-relaxed upholstery is memory foam. It adapts to pressure and heat from a patient's body, but goes back to its original form and shape once the patient steps out from the chair. It gives great patient comfort. The only limitation is memory foam cannot be upholstered without the small visible seams that we see here, hence the two different options. For hygiene, you have three important aspects to consider. Surface disinfection, waterline cleaning, and suction tube cleaning. The i5 is built of durable, recyclable, epoxy painted aluminium and designed with smooth surfaces, easy to keep clean. Where needed, there is also autoclavable barrier protection. The bowl can be removed and you can wash it in a washing machine. For waterline cleaning, we have an integrated flushing holder. Great to keep fresh water running through the instruments. The instrument delivery water supply itself is a loop, so no stagnant water is left there. For water treatment, we have different options. From periodical shock treatment 
as we do he have here, to continuous chemical or chemical-free treatment according to the user preference. We also have integrated suction tube cleaning. You connect the tube, you press a button, and you start the cleaning. There's a tank for a month's worth of suction cleaning solution. The system mixes the cleaner with the water, fills the tubes, and leaves the tubes and the coarse filters filled for two minutes, ensuring that you have a high level of hygiene. Then it empties them. The LED stripe shows the user the status of the cleaning cycles. And if you connect your i5 to the Romexis software, your cleaning cycles will also be logged. The i5 can be an integrated part of the IT environment and collect important information about the clinical workflow when connected to the Planmeca Romexis software. You can keep track of hygiene routines, track patient time in the chair, and report instrument usage, and so forth. This provides information, for example, when planned preventive maintenance is needed. The i5 allows for eight users with own instrument settings and pre-programmed chair positions to be saved. Connected to Romexis, you can have unlimited amounts of users. You can have your own ID card, and when you walk up to any dental unit in the building, you simply log in with your card and transfer your settings to that unit. The touch panel itself can also be part of the IT system, controlling the computer in the room like a touchpad. Let's end the overview of the i5 by looking at the Solana light. The arm is long, and it's long in order to accommodate all different treatment positions, from being seated in a 12 o'clock position to working with an upright seated patient. The light head itself is one piece of metal, easy to keep clean. The handles are removable and autoclavable. And the positioning of the light is very easy to do. So let's have a look at the light itself. The illuminated area is big, meaning little need for adjustment of that area during the treatment of the patient. It's also insensitive to height adjustment of the arm. The edge of the area is sharp, which is great for avoiding glare in the eye of the patient during the treatment. And when moving an object such as a hand or a head in front of the light, you see very little shadowing in the light field. Light intensity can be adjusted between 8,000 and 50,000 lux. There are also three different color temperatures available. 4,000 Kelvin, 4,500 Kelvin, and 5,000 Kelvin. 4,000 gives a good contrast of soft tissue. 5,000 good visibility on dental shade matching. And 4,500 is a compromise, a very eye-friendly working condition. In addition to that, there's a composite mode that provides a good environment for working with composite materials. In addition to this, you can have the Solana as a vision version, an over the patient light with two integrated 4K cameras. With these, you can stream video. 
you can capture video segments of the treatment process, and you can do still shots. These you can use for patient education, for communication, or for documenting the treatment process. There are microphones as well, so you can capture audio too. The Solana Vision really elevates the possibilities of what an OP light can do. The use of images for documentation is increasing all the time in dentistry, and video will follow next. There are also future development possibilities of the Solana Vision. It is a technology platform you can live with long into the future. But then again, so is the whole i5 dental unit. And that's it really. A brief overview of our most popular dental care unit. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact your local dealer or visit our homepage at planmeca.com. Thank you for your time.